that we use the right leader knots on specific um, substrates of material. Um, and I'm going to quickly show you how to tie a proper leader knot where when you join an eight pound mono and a leader line. Now you can use uh, seven pound, you can use ten pound, you can use any, but for freshwater angling we basically take the thin line and I hope you can see this I just fold it double so I've got a loop and I take my forefinger and my thumb and I pass it through and I create a secondary loop like that at this point I take my leader line I always wet the, the loop line with a little bit of saliva pass it through the loop and then I tighten it then I grab that tightened portion with the other hand and I literally pass it around once, twice, three times and I push it through that loop. At this point I wet it with saliva again and I gently gently ease the knot until I get to a point where I now have the thin line that's double with the leader knot and I pull nice and tight and then I just take my scissors and I cut it off very very close to the knot because there's nothing that can now slip again just cut off the right piece on this side and there we go now I've got a very very strong leader knot and the beauty is it is extremely small so and it's also extremely strong so really <clears throat> I'm trying to pull this to break it and it just wouldn't go this is a really really nice leader knot to use pretty much in any situation I know that a lot of the, the bass guys also use this but the majority of bank anglers are using this leader knot as it is so immensely strong.